Here's how I'm gonna replace this kitchen for just under 1,500 pounds. Keeping the sink and the cooker where they are will help you save on cost and time because you're using existing supplies and existing waste. That saves time, which then saves on cost. Then I bought a packaged kitchen from Howden's for 1,100 pounds. Flat packed, including the sink, the tap, the oven, the hob, and the extractor. An absolute bargain. But once it's in, you will be none the wiser that it wasn't a five grand kitchen because that's the price Howden's first of all priced me up. Rigid carcasses and all of the palmets and decor end panels that we don't need in this project. Little things like having the carcasses butt up against the wall means you don't need those decorative end panels. Companies will actually sell you a packaged kitchen at a loss just to get you through the door. So when they release these deals, always try and make the units that are fixed in that deal work within your space. And that's exactly what we've done. We're reducing the size, we're creating just a simple L shape with a standard fridge freezer, freestanding in the corner, with a tower unit, and then all of our base units, and a couple of wall units to finish it off. We're using the worktop that they provide, and staying with the colors that are available, and we'll just enhance the kitchen by the tiles that we put on the floor and the splashback.